what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to another reaction of peaky blinders one of the shows that i'm doing currently right now on this channel it's been going great we're four episodes in and i'm thoroughly enjoying it. let's review episode four really quick here before we jump before you go ahead and click that link in the description to go watch the reaction okay so peaky blinders episode four a um, lot of things went down in that episode, man. A whole lot of BS. A whole lot of setups. Okay, so the first one, the most important one that I want to talk about that I had very mixed feelings about because I don't know what's going to be the results of this. Aunt Paul is, she is mad at Tommy right now. She is mad at him um, because she thinks he's the one that set up Freddy. And... I mean, as much as I think the decision that Freddie made was was dumb, um, I, you know, a lot of people in the comment section was saying um, Grace was just doing her job. And I agree. She was just doing her job. But, you know, there's certain things that you just don't do. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's just certain things you just don't do. Like, you know why he's there. You know what I'm saying? Like, from a moral standpoint is what I was saying it for, you know, from a moral standpoint, it was, it, it was a bit grimy, you know what I'm saying, it was a bit grimy, I knew they needed to catch Freddy, but, you know, right in there in front of his newborn baby, man, like, that's grimy, man, that's, that's grimy, they could have at least waited outside for him to come out, or, or something, but I mean, they barged into the house, you know, um, it, it was just too much, and and they don't know that it's Grace. I think it is Grace. It, it hasn't been revealed that it was her, but we all kind of know it's her, because <laughs> she asked about it. She she asked the question, and they answered. Um, you know, I to me, I think Arthur is he's talking way too much around her, and that's gonna cause problems because. And it, she knows that all she has to do is ask Arthur about it because Arthur trusts her a lot. You know what I'm saying? Like certain things um, Tommy will tell her and, you know, keep some things from her. You know, she asks a lot of questions, bro. And I'm, I'm wondering when is it somebody is going to say, like, why does she ask so many questions about the business, about this, about that? You know what I'm saying? Like, we need to watch her more carefully. But there's nobody. Usually, um, usually in shows like this, what you see happen is you will have the person who is gullible, right? You will have the, the character that is very gullible, you know, you know, like the author right now, between the relationship between Arthur and Grace. Very gullible on Arthur's part. Um, Tommy's a little bit more reluctant in telling her things but at the same time you always have that character that's like i don't trust this bitch <laughs> you know what i'm saying but there's nobody like that you know what i'm like you know what i'm saying if anybody i would have thought that maybe john because john seems like he's the youngest out of he's the youngest brother right um and you would and he would be saying it but nobody's listening because he's the youngest right so nobody would think that he would be right even though we the audience know that he is right nobody would be believing him but that's not the case in this show so so i'm thinking i mean john they just joined the lead the lee family the lead the um the lee family and the shelbys are now connected because of the marriage so um that's a age old thing that that um people used to do that's not like a monarchy thing i didn't even know that gangs did that too back in the day where it's like you want to join two gangs get one person to marry somebody from the other family and stuff like that that's that's a a monarchy thing the olden day tradition stuff that people used to do to stop fighting and you know stop wars and stuff like that stop families from warring against each other and some and stuff like that so um at first he was against it um but then you know it is is um to be wild um it's very pretty so he was okay with 
even though the, even though that's the only thing he could have went on i mean let's be honest here that's the only thing he could have went on is is how attractive she would be he was sweating a little bit there but then when she revealed her face he's like okay i think i can do this okay so um she was pretty thrilled about it to look like she wanted to get married she she didn't mind um um, they didn't show her protesting against it or anything. So I guess she was just like, whatever, whatever it is you need, auntie, we'll, we'll get it done, <laughs> you know? So, um, but man, so now they got Freddy. Um, see, this is what I've been saying from day one, man. I was saying, yo, take the woman and run, but no, I got to stand up to Tommy. I got to, you can't run me out of town. Well, now you in jail. So. What you gonna do now, <laughs> right? Man gave you plenty of chance to get out of town, man. So many chances he got to get out of town and he refused to get out of town. Now you in jail. Now you're in jail. Probably gonna get hanged because you're a communist. So what you gonna do now? You know, so that's that's a big problem. And if, if anything, you know, he's gonna get beat up because the inspector is probably going to investigate him trying to find out where those, if he knows where the guns are, you know? So we don't know what's going to happen from this. If he releases him as an informant, you know, that he's going to be immediately suspected as an informant because they already know how ruthless um, ins the inspector can be. So we don't know what's going to happen, but let's jump into this episode, man. Go ahead. Click that li link in the description to go watch the full reaction of this episode five right now. Okay. I'm going to go and watch the episode right now also. So thank you guys for watching. And as always, it's your boy Terry by Reacts. Leave a like on this video. Peace.